Hello. Wednesday. Geogesser, my hands are very cold. Let me, let me do something about it. <clears throat> there. I had to go get a blanket shawl. Warm up a little bit. Nothing special this time. We're just uh, doing diverse world. Just cause. Um, hello. Oh, tomorrow is the 20th. Actually, the 20th is when this goes up, but y you know. It's, uh, another day of geoguessing for you. Is this Dubai? No. I don't know. <clears throat> I feel like I've been here. I gotta clear my throat. Give me one sec. All right, yes, okay, it is unmuted. Like I know those are all arrow key arrow keys, arrows pointing to locations. However, is this Dubai? Um, I don't know. There's a lot of English on these signs. A mock. What else could this potentially be? If it is not, um, Dubai, Morocco. I'm not seeing French though. Unless that said Aret. It did not. I do see serious signage. <clears throat> but can't see it from here. So we're going to go to this road. God damn, I got to cough again. Oh man, sorry. E-102. So it is Dubai. There's the E-102. Sharjah. There's Sharjah. Hamria. Hmm. I don't see Hamria anywhere. But the E-102 is right here. So maybe we're there. Like, we took a, a bit of a detour. So if I hit it home, get us back to this road, I think we might be on the... <clears throat> um, are these roundabouts? Not really. This kind of is, but whether or not we're actually on Corfacan Road is, is another thing entirely. But maybe we can find some information around this little circle. Circly do. Like this this is too well developed a highway to be that. And I'm hoping to maybe find maybe it's like this. Although we really didn't go down that many side roads to get to a roundabout. I don't know. I think this is a pretty good location to uh to guess. That's where we are. Maybe here. <clears throat> nah, I think I think this is good enough. Anyway, it is Wednesday. Very much. What's what's in the road here? Just some cardboard. <clears throat> Just me clearing my throat with some cold hands. Ah, oh, feeling tired. I've not had great sleep the past couple of weeks. Honestly, man, I got to cough again. I swear this wasn't a problem no more than 10 minutes ago, but now it is. Um, I don't know what it is. It's just like, it doesn't happen as frequently as, as it has in the past where like I can't fall asleep and then I get mad about not being able to fall asleep and then it makes me too wound up to be able to fall asleep and then in the process of actually falling asleep, I wake up and go, Am I, was that me falling asleep? And then, you know, the whole cycle happens again. It doesn't happen anywhere near as frequently. Oh, yeah, well, I guess we were a little closer over there. It doesn't happen as frequently as it used to in the past. But when it does, it's still just as annoying. <clears throat> Is this... Hmm. This is too blurred out for me to... Gonzalez? 
that looks like maybe the province this or, or that truck's in. I don't know. We're going to stick this way and try not to fall backwards, apparently. This is not the British <clears throat> side of the road. So that rules that out. However, is this Mexico? Southern America? That continent? Europe? I don't, I don't know. Give me a little bit of signage to help me out here. It's the region of the sun. Dolces. Not helpful. This might be. It's not. <laughs> no s flags. Um, <clears throat> anything else letting me know where we are. This could be Spain. This could be Mexico. RN60? This could be Brazil. Very dry section of Brazil. Oh, man, it's, it's just perfectly, like, aligned where I'm not going to be able to see that. Um, come on, help me out here. Pack a door? No, no I'm gonna, not going to try fighting that one. Maybe this will... DNV, no, that doesn't help me. Green sign might. What do we got? Termos descent, that, nope, that does not help me. Gas station. I'm feeling South America. Oh, we've got a detour, huh? <clears throat> and we just ignore it. Let's see, we got administration. All right, we got to look for this public administration province of Vialidad. I'm not seeing any. Nope. Nothing here telling me where this is. So I don't know. Villa Mazan. I think this is. Um, <clears throat> Central and or South America. This is just so infuriating that I, I can't narrow it down anymore with any sense of uh, confidence. What's this say? Nope, that doesn't help me. It's very mountainous up here. Like, this feels like it could be the Andes? But also, it could be just Mexican mountainous. Like, got a cough again, sorry. Termas de Santa Maria. Like, I, eh. It's, it's not helpful. Maybe this. There are some. None of those help. Amo Gasta Bellin. I think. I'm confident in saying that this is probably, like, here somewhere. Amo Gasta. Let me, I'm adjusting a blanket that I'm wearing. <clears throat> Amo Gasta, Bellin, Tino Gasta. Hmm. Any of those going to show up? Like, I'm, like, 50-50 that I'm going to be on the wrong continent. This feels like it's down here, though. I find Bellin. Like, these are tiny enough that it's, it's not going to help me. <clears throat> Man. Um, all right, let's, let's see how bad I got it. Eh, it wasn't too bad. Not too bad at all. But uh, yeah, I was, I was, I don't think I was going to get any closer than that without some dumbass luck. Speaking of dumbass luck, um, I feel like that's what I need to actually make any progress in, um, 
the Road to Tarkov game. I'm still playing it badly, mind you. And it's it's a bit frustrating because um I'm like level eight. And in order to actually like sell anything on the marketplace they have in the game, I gotta get to level ten. <clears throat> and I have not been able to actually like live in a raid probably in a week. And the difference between like the amount of EXP you get for living and dying is significant, we'll say. Say like I kill a person and then I die in the raid. That's maybe six to eight hundred exp but if you kill somebody and then leave that's like like 1000 to 2000 exp it's it's it, it, it there's quite a bit of difference and i've just been slowly plodding along with anywhere between like i've gotten zero exp before because i had such an awful spawn between two places and i'm like i'm screwed here if i like try to run anywhere i'm just gonna get shot and kept thinking going back between a couple of different areas, being like, oh, what am I going to do? Am I going to go, am I going to go here? Uh, let's give it a shot. And then I ended up getting shot. And I'm like, great. Spent all this time running around, got nowhere, died, zero EXP. And I'm just bad. Estacio, no, I'm not going to try. I think this might be South America again. But can't tell yet it's uh frustrating so i'm like i feel like i should be better than this i watch other people play and i'm like man they get fortunate breaks yes <clears throat> people do end up dying a lot but still they're like like functional they're they're able to do things and i'm just like i feel like i can do that then i'm like yeah let's go into it and play a little bit more then i die i'm like god damn it it's happened again and i'm just trying to get to level 10, because I feel like that's, that's a goal I can get, but I'm so far away, and I have been forever, that it's just very discouraging. So, give me... Ooh. <clears throat> fin del Mundo. Porto Natales. This is an interesting sign. I have not seen this sign before. Fin del Mundo. It's the end of the world, so I feel like maybe we're down here. There's Punta Arena, so look at me figuring out languages. <clears throat> Let's see. Tehuelches. There's Villa Tehuel that's like 30-something or other. So maybe we're like hmm. Port Natal's, where, where, that's like way up there. Moro Chico's got to be like somewhere there. 34 kilometers to that. So maybe we're like here. Like maybe right there, I'll say. I don't think we've gotten to that intersection. No, maybe not. Let's, let's, let's find out. We found like a, that word but I don't think it's going to show up on this. So let's, let's continue a bit more. And I keep tier, like going back and forth, people are like, I should just stop playing this game because it's too frustrating for me. And then I stop playing for a while, and I'm like, all right, maybe I'll try again, and then I die again, and it's just the cycle starts again. <clears throat> so it, it, it's just a matter of me actually feeling like I should bother putting in the time with something like that, or do something else. Like read the, the Witcher book that finally came in after almost a month of uh, being lost in limbo, essentially. And it's a thick one, way thicker than any of the other versions, uh, volumes of the Witcher up to this point. Man, my, my throat. I'm sorry, it's, it's still fighting me here. Well, we weren't that far off. Not that far at all. Moving on. Well, we're not out in the middle of the desert this time. However, this is... Central Europe. Where in Central Europe, I don't know. Tell me. 
plenty of places definitely has a URL. You're just you're just being difficult. Initially thinking Poland. Like that's got dot H U? Yep, Hungary. Alright, so we're in Hungary. Which location in Hungary? I don't know. I need a bit more information. Let's see. There's a Lytle. Souls knock. Um, I'm just going to go down this main thoroughfare until I potentially see some more information. Ooh, there's a KFC here. I wonder what they sell at this KFC. I can't go down that road. I can go down that road. Where is it? No, I think actually what it is is it's probably on this. Then I take this road to find that KFC. I just want to see what they're selling at a Hungarian KFC. Or maybe it's either that, or I had to go 1.2 kilometers down that road and then take a left. So we're gonna head back out. This is my new goal. Find this KFC. Like I'm probably just gonna go ahead and guess that this is probably like Budapest, even though it's not. I don't see a river anywhere. I mean, it, it's it the uh, Budapest is more than just one river here, but it's in the center of the country. It's a it's a safe bet, to say the least. Although maybe this might actually have some more. It's a bigger road, so maybe it'll have some signage somewhere. It'll let me know where I'm going. Signage has run out. Um, head back this way. Let's see. I mean, I want... Why, why aren't you... Thank you. Let me do an intersection. Did I pass an intersection? I kind of did. That's not really a big enough road. This is, though. What do we got? Seeing a lot of souls knock, so maybe that's where we are. Is there such a thing as a souls knock? Looking, I am not seeing it. Musactly, no. I mean, this is a big enough town. It feels like that it should probably show up this far out of uh. But I'm not seeing it. Let's see. Ooh, who are these people? Oh, they're just chefs. Well, that's a beach. But I don't think there's, there's like lakes and whatnot, but... See, oh fuck, that's, that's not it. Thought it potentially could have been. Man, there's like, that's a cool looking little piece of art though. I mean, it's just a hill covered in bricks by the looks of it. If it ever focuses, thank you. Let's see. Ooh, it's fall now. Uh, Amadeus Radio. Amadeus FM 102.4. All the Mozart you ever want. I think that's, yeah, it's got to be. <clears throat> so they do have caps here. I am just feeling like I'm going up and down the same road. And now we're not moving. Thank you. Um, is that a fort or a weird looking water tower? I'm going to make my guess. Soul's not. I couldn't see it on blind as a bat. Literally, probably. Gazed over four or five times without paying attention. That's my poor vision for you. This, I think I might have some difficulty finding out where we are. <clears throat> Mountainous. Hi, I got a cough again. Sorry. 
All right, I think this might be Eswatini. It's where I'm starting to lean. Um, just because I remember last time, I think we were in Eswatini, it was this hilly. Although there's more trees this time. Can I get maybe like a little bit of signage to help me out here? Masa Bielen. See, there's a lot of flat plateaus here. But I can't tell which way the car is, so I can't very much guess as to where we are just yet. Oh, well, the road seems to be narrowing a smidge. Um, hmm. I think, oh wait, I'm going to make my quick guess here. And it's going to be a little quick for the final one, just because something has just come up, and my apologies, but I will have to cut this one short. I'm going to say we're there. I'm going to make my guess. Oh, it was one of the two. And I'm going to thank you for watching this week's GeoGuessr. Apologies, this one's a little brief again, but things happen sometimes. If you have any comments, questions, concerns, complaints, tips, hints, suggestions for me, go ahead and put them down below. I will read them and get back to you. Go enjoy your Wednesday. I will be here to see you Friday. Some more GeoGuessr. Take care.